Welcome to this Windows channel and this is the tech news for Thursday, December the 10th, 2015. Today in our news, there's been an update to the film and TV app for Windows 10 or as some countries call it, the movies and TV apps. It's mostly of functionality so when you now have, um, you know, movies or TV shows, there's more information, you know, about the actors and all stuff like that, uh, knowing when it was made. Uh, you know, the information at the base was very limited when you uh, clicked a movie, and now it's much more complete. Uh, and this is a update that is on Windows PCs, tablets, and also on Windows 10 phone. So uh, they are making this slightly better as time goes by. Hopefully, uh, it's going to get even more interesting. And uh, it is interesting to see that they call it movies and TV on some platforms and film and TV on others. Always kind of uh, a little um, weird. I always thought that, you know, probably depends on how we uh, call. Uh, here in Canada, it's film and TV, which is very interesting. So an updated app, a few more information. You know, it's part of Windows 10. Um, universal apps and general apps that are being updated all the time even though there are no updates you know like Windows updates and stuff like that and uh, in our continuing news we have update for Xbox One so if you have an Xbox One there's a update that rolled out yesterday so make sure that you update your machine no new features it's mainly bug fixes from what we know so if you've been having crashes, problems, blue screens, anything, uh, update your system. It fixes apparently um, a certain number of bugs in the Windows Xbox One uh, operating system. Well, it's official. Mozilla Firefox OS, or Fire OS as some called it, and uh, the possibility of a F Mozilla or a Firefox smartphone is gone. Mozilla did announce that uh, they are stopping uh, the development of the OS and also a smartphone. They're not going to do it. You know, it's kind of tough. Uh, we got to remember that, uh, you know, a, a giant like Microsoft barely makes 2%, 3% in the market share of phones. So imagine, um, you know, getting a new smartphone out there in the market. I think it's something really tough. I think that's what they... They also uh, have seen that it wasn't easy, and also uh, they probably have seen that it's um, a little uh, complex, you know, to build all of that, and it costs a lot of money. So uh, gone is the dream of having a Mozilla OS. I would have liked the OS though, you know, even though they wouldn't make a phone, it would have been f really nice to have maybe a Firefox operating system that would be in, uh, installed on PCs. That I would love to see, but unfortunately, all of that is something that will never happen now. Uber has a universal app for Windows 10. So if you're a, a Uber user, well, now you can actually, um, you know, have your favorite um, Uber taxi with Windows 10 phone, Windows 10 tablets, and Windows 10 PCs. And finally, in a demonstration, Microsoft accidentally um, had Microsoft Edge demonstrated with extensions. And that is very, very interesting because um, it means that they're not very far away from having an update of the Microsoft Edge operating system with some extensions. So we expect to have um, updates very soon, uh, maybe, you know, a um, insider preview of course because I think insiders will be the first ones to test the possibility of extensions but uh, that's interesting to see and you know what another piece of news that's interesting we thought that Microsoft Edge extension would come only maybe in Redstone but now it's not clear it seems that maybe extensions would appear sometime in the spring so we might have a update that brings a new Edge browser with extensions which is what a lot of people are waiting for, basically. So that's uh, interesting news to uh, check for. So that's the news for today, Thursday, December the 10th, 2015. If you enjoy our videos, why not subscribe? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you like our videos, give us thumbs up. 
and hopefully you will continue following us and if you have any comments questions suggestions or maybe a feature you'd like me to make a video of let us know and we'll try to post that video online thank you for following us